Hi St John's, hope you are all doing really well. Those of you on half term, I hope you're having a good half term. It's been pretty grotty weather, but hopefully you found something fun to do. Um, whatever the case, the church is open and we'd love to see you on Sundays. Do come and join us in the building. We've not had to turn anyone away yet. So uh, even if you chance your arm last minute, you should be able to get in. I know it's a bit different for the children and youth. Those spaces are quite limited but we would love to see more adults in the building. Having said that, next Sunday, this is Sunday the 8th of November, we have Remembrance Sunday and the service will be at 10.45 a.m. and we would love you to book tickets for that one because we'll also have lots of members of the community coming then and we'd really love to prioritise those people from outside of the church to have a chance to come to church on that Sunday. But please do book tickets and we'll release tickets for for our church community as well. On Monday, uh, this coming Monday, we've got our All Souls Day service as well, 4.30 in the afternoon, uh, where we remember loved ones that we have lost. We read a book of remembrance, light a candle, and look to God for the hope uh, that he can give us. Also on Monday, uh, in the evening, we have the first night of our Give Up or Grow course, and it's a chance to kind of think how do we keep mentally healthy during this season of uncertainty and that's going to be a great evening I really recommend you get along to that one it's on zoom so very easy to get there you know this last week um i've been reading kate patterson's excellent book living for eternity we've also had talks last sunday which uh, touched on the subject of eternity and uh, I was drawn to this, this passage in uh, John 11, which you may know well. When Martha's brother Lazarus died, Jesus said to Martha these uh, famous words, I am the resurrection and the life. The one who believes in me will live, even though they die. And whoever lives by believing in me will never die. Do you believe this? I can imagine Jesus looking Martha in the eye at that point saying, do you believe this? You are never going to die. This earthly body, yes, will die, but you will not die. I wonder if you just let that sink in right now, today. You know, it is radically life transforming. Imagine you were going on a, on a plane journey to the most beautiful place you could imagine. And you were told, by God, this plane will get there safely. You don't need to worry. It is a secure journey. It wouldn't matter how much turbulence you had on that journey. You would always have hope. We're going to arrive safely. It'll be okay. And it transforms the journey. And I really hope, as you just lean into those words of Jesus, that you will never die. That you can have a radically transformed day transform week, transform life to go through this journey with that hope in mind. God bless you. Have a good week. Bye.